What's good, everybody? N.W. Piper. Still chooching on my Savinelli 316 with uh, Ahab's Comfort, Lane Ready Rub, and uh, Peterson's Standard Mixture. Um, I just had those three laid out in my tray from, you know, previous smokes where I didn't use all the tobacco and um, put it all together. Oh my gosh, you guys. Taking a short break before I head out to the house on the coast. And um, I am getting worked, y'all. I don't want to bellyache because I don't like those type of videos where I make it all about my sore back and my, my sore legs and my sore feet. So let's just say that things are different now than they were about 20 years ago. <laughs> oh gosh, you guys. Oh, but good news, making progress. Um, we should be in our home next weekend um, is the goal. And we're moving right along. Got the flooring all ripped out. The house is all painted. Um, we get flooring windows tomorrow, fencing in tomorrow. And then uh, we'll be in there. So looking forward to that. And um, then after we're all moved in, I can focus on my, my manhole, my man cave. And I'm just really getting so much inspiration from so many of your guys' videos on what that's going to look like when it's done. Um, one of the things that I really look forward to putting in there, and I know this sounds weird, but you know those old classic 10 pictures? They're called 10 pictures. 10 pictures I think they're made out of 10 like aluminum or metal and uh, there are various different things uh, you know cigarettes or pipe tobaccos or um, Route 66 or um I don't know, maybe like weird aftershave, like Gillette, or I don't know, just those old timey tin art uh, signs, um, vintage signs is what they're called. I want some of them in there. And um, I was watching a video yesterday and this individual, I would give him a shout out if I could remember his name, but um, he had an American flag up over his window, looked kind of cool. Uh, an old school radio. But it was weird, it was an old school radio, but it had Bluetooth. Um, so I'd like to get that in there, or maybe a yeah, like an old school radio. Maybe not a, I don't know, maybe a record player. So did you guys know at Walmart and some other places, they're coming back out with vinyl, you guys. So if I got me a record player in there, I could be uh, cranking the ABBA, the ABBA. They're going back on tour. Remember those guys, Abba, Dancing Queen. So, uh, definitely going to get an old school radio in there. I would order this stuff up right now, but man, I just don't have nowhere to put any of all that stuff. And I, we're about ready to get into some rain on the coast here. So. But I am getting my Amazon wish list together. 
um, with a lot of that stuff. And uh, hopefully by winter I'll have that thing all done. But everything's going good. I stepped on an old rusted staple yesterday. went right through my foot when I was pulling up all that f old flooring. So if I talk and my jaw locks up, you'll know why. Um, so that hurt. Let's see, what else has been going on? Uh, no dry rot or anything in that house, which has been cool. Nothing nothing is worse when you guys get into a project and, you know, you start tearing things apart and it's rotted. And then you tear a little more and it's rotted and it's rotted. And then part of you is like, man, I don't want to tear up anymore because I'm afraid this whole thing's rotted. But thank the Lord, there's no rot on our property at all. No dry rot. So, that's good. Now, I've yet to pull out the windows, so we'll see about that. But the windows were those old aluminum single pane glass windows. Um, and there's definitely been moisture getting in around them. So we'll have to see about that. Oh, one of the cool things in the bathroom, the previous owner of this home had put in uh, boudets, boudets. And um, I don't know, that's been a different experience. Trying to figure out what that's all about. I could just see the grandbabies coming over and thinking it's like a water fountain <laughs> and trying to get a drink. So I might have to school them on what that's all about when they before they come over. Um, so loving this mixture. Um, yeah, I came home and I was going to get some haunted bookshop in here because I wanted some a good burly, but had all this stuff laying out and being that I'm cheap. I'd like to use, actually thrifty is probably a better word. Thought I would use up what I had. Be a good steward of my tobacco. And uh, yeah, really enjoying it. So on this particular property, we've got a bunch of RVers going up and down our road. They like to camp out over, up up the river here, there's a camp place for them all and they'd be bringing their big old fifth wheelers up this road here. So anyway, you guys have a wonderful weekend coming up, Friday here on the Oregon coast. And um, be safe, enjoy your family, and uh, hope you got uh, some downtime from work. And get you some tobacco and a pipe you like, and enjoy your weekend. I'll catch you guys on the next one. Wish me luck on the house. Blessings.